بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله على سيدنا محمد وعلى اله وصحبه اجمعين اما بعد my dear brothers and sisters in islam today i will be talking to you about the mercy and the kindness of the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam and we know for the fact that rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam was the mercy not only for the mankind but for for the for all the creations allah subhanahu wa ta'ala created in this universe and out of this universe in any planet out there i'll i'll discuss with you one story regarding the bedouin who came to the prophet's mosque and he started urinating obviously the sahaba radiyallahu anhum rushed towards him and uh, wanted to admonish him and just you know the reaction was a little harsh to his that sahabi who urinated rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam was uh, available there and he stopped the sahaba radiyallahu anhum ajma'in and said hey stop let him urinate and let him finish the things then once he was done rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam asked the sahaba radiyallahu anhum ajma'in to pour a bucket of water over there this is one of the incident i just wanted to share this is the kindness rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam had for each and every one he knew that this sahabi this badwin who came to the prophet's mask and he is not aware of the fact that you know we shouldn't be urinating here this is not the place where we can relieve ourselves this is one thing the second thing uh, what i just wanted to discuss with you here is regarding the anas ibn malik radiyallahu anhu anas ibn malik himself narrates that i was into the service of rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam for 10 years and he says that rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam never said off to me i mean he never rebuked him he never admonished him he never said off can you imagine that uh, rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam didn't have a situation where he should get angry where he should rebuke where where should he should admonish anas ibn malik radiyallahu anhu but anas ibn malik himself says that in 10 years time i never had an incident where rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam admonished him and even he used the word of he never said to me of why did you do so why did you do such and such thing There are many instances there are many incident where Rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam was on the highest level of the mercy of Rasulullah on the highest level of kindness and this mercy was not only for the mankind but for the animal even for all the creations out there That's why Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala himself describes about the mercy of the Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam that fa bima rahmatin min Allah linta lahum walaw kunta faddan ghaliz alqalb lan faddu min hawlik that it's it's a great mercy of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala that you have been kind to them had you been harsh and hard hearted towards them they would have all broken away they would have all gone away from you This is how Rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam used to treat uh, all the people even the children with all the respect with all the kindness with all the mercy This is one of the quality we have to try to imbibe in ourselves we should work on it and it's it's a kind of a practice we have to keep imbibing we have to keep learning we have to keep Uh, working on the uh, on this quality and try to imbibe the same in ourselves thank you so much jazakumullah khair assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh dear audience we appreciate your support thanks for watching um network and keep sharing and subscribing because sharing goodness is sadaqah assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh